Hello friends, we are going to see scaffold column data annotation attribute in MVC Freezer. Now the scaffold column attribute hides a property from HTML helper such as data for model or display for model. That means if you have a model class and you are going to render control for each property using data for model or display for model helper, you can skip or you can hide the control for a for any property and using scaffold column. I mean for any property whose scaffold column is set to false that property will not be shown on the form or on the UI and this attribute accepts a boolean parameter and with the attribute in place rate of a model will not render the control for a property for which this attribute is set to null I mean, as said earlier if a scaffold column is set to false for any property that property will be left from the left from displaying on the UI or on the, from, the, from the form so let's see through the code how we can use a scaffold column now suppose uh, we have a register class that is basically a model class we have a view and on the view we are using a data for model to render control or editor for each property and we are rendering this all the controls inside a form and using the submit button we are going to post this form or we can post this form and let's on the register model we will set scaffold column to false for city property now let's uh, for instance uh, run application and see how our forms how our form look and how many properties are rendered on the form or on the ui now as you can see we have five properties on in the model class and and on the ui five controls are rendered according to the property now let's stop the application and i'll say scaffold column and I set it to false for city property now according to scaffold false for city property the city property will not be shown on the UI now let's run the application and see whether city property is shown on the UI or not So as you can see only four controls have been rendered on the form or on the UI so uh, so the city property set to false uh, for scaffold column uh, hides the property or hides the control uh, from the UI and that property is not rendered on the UI so whenever you want to skip any property from rendering suppose you have some ID that is user ID uh, which you don't want to render on the UI level you can just set scaffold column false uh, to that property so that property will be hidden from the form or from the UI in case where you are using editor for model to render the controls so this is how the scaffold column works thank you friends